Hey guys, in this video today, I'm going to do a Timu unboxing, or Temu, however you want to say it. Um, so basically, it's this uh, newer shopping website. Um, they have an app, it's real easy to use. Um, a lot of people kind of compare it to a, uh, a Wish or something like that, um, but it's supposed to be better quality, and uh, the shipping is supposed to be a little bit better, uh, especially if it's coming from overseas but anyway just wanted to uh, do a uh, unboxing and show you what I got uh, give you uh, my perspective on some of the items uh, one of the reasons I did this video is because I was looking on YouTube for reviews and um, mostly everything is you know it looks like a lot of you know women doing reviews and stuff which is great but I just I was looking for like a guy's perspective and um, just wanted to kind of see if they have any, any guy items and stuff like that, but they have a ton of stuff, almost everything you could imagine, um, you know, maybe not as much as like an Amazon, but um, they've got plenty, plenty of things for everyone. Um, they have men's, women's clothes, children's stuff, um, everything for the house, car accessories, um, kitchen gadgets, all that. So I'll show you some of the stuff I got, but Anyway, pretty cool so far. Um, my order it took 10 days. Um, I think I ordered it, yeah, 10 days ago I ordered it. Just came today. Um, package came in. Just a bag like this. Um, I'll try to throw a picture in just to show you what it looked like before I opened, uh, opened the package. But um, so far it doesn't look like anything was damaged, which is good. Um, some people will say on YouTube, like, and also just also just to explain, this is not a sponsored video. I bought all this stuff with my own money, um, just trying it out for the first time. Um, but hey, Tamu, if you want to sponsor me, I'll take free stuff. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I uh, just want to kind of give you guys some insight, let you see what I got, and uh, let's just jump right into it. All right, and I also got the uh, learned about this from. I don't know if you've ever heard of freaking reviews, James White. He's got a big uh, following over on his channel. He uh, does a bunch of reviews on like as seen on TV stuff, but he did a, his own uh, Tamu haul and uh, had some pretty cool items on there. And that's where I learned about it and uh, wandered into it. But I'll just jump right in, show you what I got. I'll just go through my order one thing at a time, give you the price that I paid and uh, show you what it looks like. All right. Um, it's just a variety of things for the house, for my wife, for myself, uh, a couple of things for our girls. Um, and the first item see here is for the kitchen. And these, it's a four piece set of sponges, uh, kitchen sponges. Um, so you can see it's kind of got like a uh, scratchy surface. Um, the shiny part that's for like scrubbing and so it's like a sponge on the inside and the scrubby part on the outside and four pack of these was 78 cents so not too bad um, cheaper than if you were to go to the dollar store um, so that's first item um, okay second item right here and the this right here this is um a coral fleece microfiber bath towel. Um, wife and I, our towels are getting a little bit older and wanted to try some new ones, but before committing to a whole new set, just want to try out a couple different uh, types of towels. Um, I want to try a microfiber towel, see how this works out. So I haven't tried it yet, but I'm just opening it up. See the texture there and the dimensions of this I believe it's about like 55 by 27 something like that can't see it in the whole frame but it's pretty big um, so again that's the pattern and texture of it feels nice and soft um, I'll have to try it out. It's got a little uh, little hang tag on there, a little loop, hang it up so it can dry. 
Um, so quality of this seems really nice. Um, I'm happy with that. Give it a shot. All right, and that was for that one towel. That was ten dollars and forty-eight cents. Um, all right. So next item. Let's see here, we got kitchen tongs. Um, so we got so I got a new non-stick pan. Actually, the blue diamond pan. It's been pretty good so far, but it's non-stick, and I don't want to use metal tongs on it. So I got some silicone tip tongs right here. It's got a little lever that you can pull, release it, pull it in, close it, and you can see the silicone there. And I have to say, the quality of this is uh, very good. About the same, if not better, than the other ones I have. Um, and it's got the silicone tip, so a little grip there. And these were only $3.98. So, pretty good deal. Happy with that. All right. Let's see. On to the next item. We got, got this right here for one of my daughters for her bath. These are microfiber washcloths. I'll open them up. Okay, there we go. And these are roughly, I think they're about 11 inches by 11 inches. Um, you can see that kind of the same textures that other towel right there. And these are, it's a five pack. Um, and these were $3.99. So. Not too bad. Uh, again, this will be for uh, one of the girls for their bath. All right. And the next item is, got this for my wife. She's got brushes and combs, and this is a comb cleaning claw or cleaning brush. Came in a box like this. Box is a little crushed, but we'll see how the... Uh, cleaning brush made out if it's damaged or not. Okay. All right, so this is it right here. It's got this area here, the brush, these bristles, and then these are like hard plastic. Get in the brush and get out all the hair that's stuck in there. So my wife's got a lot of hair and my other four-year-old has a lot of hair. So between their two brushes, this should come in handy, help them clean it. Um, and then looks like it came with this other little tool. Not too sure what this is for, but came with it as well. And this set right here, this was a dollar and 98 cents. So not too bad. And the quality looks to be pretty nice. It's gray and white. Not bad. All right, next thing, moving on. All right, so got a couple USB-C cables. One for the car, one for the bedroom. And all right, first one here, right there. This one is a 90 degree USB-C cable, uh, USB-A to USB-C and this is red, obviously. This was three dollars and nine cents. Take that real quick. All right, so you can see the USB A right there. It's USB C, and it's the ninety degree angle. So I like these for the phones. Um, so if you're holding your phone, it's coming out the bottom. Um, it's not going to mess with the port that much. It's not going to move around a whole lot. It's a little sturdier, I feel. So got that. $3.09. All right. 
All right, next one's another USB-C cable, USB-A to USB-C. This one's just, uh, just one for the car. Does It's not a 90 degree. And was $2.69. Show you this. There we go. There. All right. Pretty basic. It's got a nice nylon sheathing over the cable. And these, they're both, the cables are both 6.6 .6 feet, something like that. Um, and uh, this one, again, was $2.69. So pretty good price for a cable like that. Moving on to the next item. We got, it's for the kitchen. Um, these kitchen organization this is a three pack of cord organizers for uh, like kitchen um, say like a mixer or a crock pot uh, some of your kitchen items that could use a little bit of cord management cable management um, and then these right here they you can see Take one out. Here's a gray one. Comes with white and black as well. And then comes with these adhesive backs. So you can just put it on the back here. And then you just stick this on the back of your kitchen appliance. Um, and then you just wrap the cord around here. And keeps the cord out of the way and nice and neat. All right, cool. This three pack was only a dollar sixty eight, so not too bad. All right, next item on the list is um, oh, this is interesting. I actually used this earlier. Um, one of the things I was able to test out so far, it is not an antenna. <laughs> this is a sandwich bag holder. So like a Ziploc bag, um, basically you take the one end of the zip, the one opening of the Ziploc bag and stuff it up in here, slide it up right here, take the other part, slide it up and it's opened up. And then this frees up your hands to then go put whatever you need to put into the Ziploc baggie. So I used it earlier, put some leftovers, uh, pasta into a bag and it's worked beautifully. So I was able to, I didn't have to like fumble around one hand trying to keep the bag open, the other hand trying to put the pasta in and just put the Ziploc bag in here, kept it open, put the leftovers in, simple as that. And it does extend. If you have the big freezer bags, you can use the extension. Put it back down. And then folds up so it can store it away pretty easily doesn't take up much space awesome and this was only a dollar 68 so another great deal all right moving on next item this is a little bit more pricey but um this will come in handy in the kitchen for my daughter right now she was actually using it earlier my four-year-old she uh loves to help my mom or her mommy and Daddy in the kitchen. Um, this is a stool. Okay, it's a folding stool. There you go. See, takes up barely any space. Can slide it next to the fr refrigerator or the closet real easily, and just opens up just like that. And the weight limit on this, this is a smaller stool. The weight limit on this, I believe it said it was 80 kilograms. Forget how much that works out to um, off, off hand, but I believe it's at least, uh, it's at least 160 to 70 pounds, something like that. Um, I might not be able to get on this, but my wife and daughter, they definitely can use this. So anyway, so this was uh, 
$13.48. Um, not too bad. I mean, might be able to get something on another site for a little bit more, um, but not too bad of a price for this. And uh, it's already come in handy so far, so I'm happy with it. All right, next item on the list. We got a all right, a quick dry microfiber drying ball, round microfiber cloth as they call it. And this is what it looks like. This looked pretty popular. Saw a lot of people were getting these on the on the site. So I figured I would just give it a shot. Some some people said they their kids use too many paper towels and then trying to give them this to save paper towels. Um, so I'll try it as well. And show you. All right, so it's got a little loop to hang. And it's like a chenille microfiber. Kind of looks like, reminds you of like one of those microfiber car wash mitts. But it feels nice. Quality seems like it's it's there. On the inside, it's got like a foam core. So it's not really a ball, as you can see. It's, it's round, though. Um, it's got the microfiber on all the sides. But this uh, seems pretty cool. So I guess you wash your hands and then go to dry. Do it like this. So instead of using a bunch of paper towels. Um, yeah, so I think this is pretty cool. And this was only... A dollar and forty-eight cents. Um, pretty, pretty good deal. Not bad. So give this a shot. All right, next item. Uh, this item's for me. And uh, taking out the trash. I've got an old pair of gloves. They're all beat up. I just want to get a pair of um, gloves that I could use for taking out the trash or maybe shoveling uh, in the winter. Um, up in Northeast and in PA. We haven't gotten a lot of snow so far, knock on wood. But I thought these might come in handy. These are tactical gloves, they're called, but I just really got them kind of like work gloves, taking out the trash and chores, stuff like that. Um, but you can see we got some a little bit of protection here. All right, it says discovery. All right, and then these have touch sensitive uh, finger and thumb right here. So should hopefully be able to use my smartphone, the screen while I have these on. And got a Velcro line. Velcro wrist closure. And the inside is, let me show you, nice fleece line. So these are nice and warm, looks like here. And I'm gonna go try them on. I just guessed on the size. I bought a size large and they fit. So not bad. The quality's really nice. I like these a lot. So these will be perfect for taking out the trash or Say working on a car or something and shoveling snow nice and warm these right here were twelve dollars and 48 cents so not too bad i'm quite happy with that so again tactical gloves twelve dollars 48 cents awesome moving on to the next item all right this right here I got for my wife. It is a pedicure set. Um, it's right here. It's got, let's see, one, two, three, four. Looks like it's about like a five piece set. And uh, it's got like some files in the back there. This right here, this right here, and these I believe are 
foot scrapers um, for like the bottom of your feet. If you got like calloused feet, which uh, not gonna lie, I might have to try these out. Could use these to clean out my feet a little bit. <laughs> um, but uh, got like the file. This thing, I have no clue what this is. I think this is another type of file or emery board type of thing. One of these guys. Uh, uh, some pedicure set for my wife and this was two dollars and twenty four cents so I mean the material it's you know it's plastic um, but for what you're getting you know not too bad I mean this part's metal scraper part that's metal um, the other stuff's basically plastic but uh, quality seems decent especially for the price I mean two dollars and twenty four cents not bad all right moving on we got two items left um, the next item I got for my daughter's room, she uses a million tissues. I uh, wake up in the morning and there's like 50 tissues on the ground, it seems like sometimes. Um, so I got her a trash can for her room. A little feet on it. This is like a uh, elephant design, gray and green, white. A little bit of pink and gold so this will match in her room I guess with the colors but um, it's got one of those lids on it that you can put one of those clear trash bags or a plastic bag from the store whatever you want to use put that inside with the lid lid on top keep the bag down um, but yeah this will be great in my my one daughter's room and help keep it clean without all those tissues on the ground so this right here was $6.48, which is definitely money well spent for keeping her room clean. So there you go. That's that. All right, and the last item I thought was really cool. I haven't opened it yet, but it is one of those electric plasma arc lighter things. So instead of using like a, an actual open flame, like those Bic lighters, this right here is good for lighting candles, for your birthday cakes, or if you're into candles in the house, um, whatever you need a lighter for. If, the, if say your grill igniter doesn't work, you can use this on your grill. Um, starting a you know fire in your fire pit if you need. So let me see, take it out, see if it actually has any juice in it. And again, it's a. Uh, arc barbecue lighter usb usb powered which is usb rechargeable which is pretty cool um i think it's usb c if i'm not mistaken I'll find out let me check it out there we go uh yes it is usb c so awesome, I love USB-C. Okay, and here it is. There we go, got a little loop on the end here. It's a little flexible neck. There's the tip right there. All right, and let's see. Ooh, there we go, it's the power button switch right there see that try not to burn myself um actually yeah that's actually just a flashlight i forgot that's just a flashlight right there it's built in as well but let me see if it'll light oh, there we go flashlight off so you can see oh I guess the flashlight has to be on but I guess you can see that 
little arc right there. I'm trying to get it in focus for you. But that is pretty cool. Awesome. I did want when I want to get one of these for a while and uh, found it on Tamo. And there's the port right there to charge it. Um, so this right here was six dollars and twenty nine cents, which uh, I think it's a pretty good deal. I mean, those big lighters, I probably get them at the dollar store or whatever. But this right here, it's rechargeable, USB C, um, no open flame, so I feel like it might be a little bit safer, but also just getting more life out of it. it's rechargeable and uh, looks really cool. So yeah, I'm I'm really happy with this. I'm gonna have fun playing with this. So anyway, um, that's all the items for today. The total, the order was actually before any discounts. Order came to seventy-two dollars and eighty cents. Um, I had a, uh, I was able to get a thirty percent off coupon. I got a coupon code from uh, from someone else, and so that saved me twenty-one dollars and eighty-four cents, which was nice. So the, the actual order total for 15 items came to $50.96 free shipping um, actually there was tax $3.04 total order was $54 after a discount 30% discount um, again free shipping so as far as I can tell they usually offer free shipping at least for your first order or two and then it seems like they may have free shipping um, after that, they have like a counter that says free shipping, but I wonder if it's one of those psychological things where it makes you think that you got to jump on it to get the free shipping. But anyway, I had a good experience with Tamu so far. Um, thinking about putting another order in, some other stuff around the house, car. Um, you really could find a lot of stuff. They have really good deals on looks like Bluetooth, earbuds, and headphones. I don't need any right now, but if you're in need of them, looks like it's a pretty good uh, deals on those like Lenovo Think Plus brand, um, like the over the ears, the in ear buds, ones that look like AirPods, stuff like that. Um, pretty cheap. So anyway, just want to uh, give you some impressions, a little insight. Uh, I mean, everything was good so far. I didn't really have to deal with customer service or anything, but I hear they have good customer service. Everything came in undamaged, um, which I'm happy with. So I don't have to return anything or reach out to customer service. So I'm happy with that. And I'll definitely uh, consider ordering again from them. Um, shipping times again, they usually tell you within about like, I would say one to two weeks, but most things I think they say come within like 10 days or less, uh, most items. And uh, yeah, so mine did. It was 10 days exactly. But yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this. Um, hope it helps you a little bit if you're thinking about trying Temu. Uh, the app is really easy. Uh, you can use the website on the you know computer or laptop or whatever, but the app just you know makes it easier. So uh, yeah, give it a shot. Um, and uh, I'll put a little link in the description uh, if you want to check it out. But other than that, Thank you for watching. Uh, maybe I'll do another video on an update on using or reviewing any of the products. But uh, that's it for now. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Take care.